Ooh-wee, guys. We're here. I thought it would take a lot longer, but thanks to a certain well-endowed YouTuber, we've hit 2,500 subscribers in just over two months. I think that's reason to celebrate and have a drink, but then I was going to do that anyway. So, as promised, here are the answers to the questions you lovingly put up when we hit 1,000 subs. So, first up, we have Toast Gaming asks, Polish Sausage? Or it could be Polish Sausage, I don't know. Either way, yeah, I'm up for that. Muzzy100 wants to know what's my preferred pronouns. Um, his, him, yeah, pre pretty simple. Iris Mercury wants to know what's your favourite ice cream flavour. Yeah, I'm pretty boring where that's concerned, Iris. Just give me vanilla, none of that chocolate chip bullshit. Alco Heretic asks, how glorious are my titties? You know I'm still waiting for those pics, bitch. I'll let you know when I get them. Chenny June, oh, Chenny's got a big one. You have a gun with only one bullet and are trapped in a room with Lindsay from Queer Kid Stuff, Milo Stewart and Angry Mugtow. What do you do? I think I'd do what any sane person would do, shoot myself in the head and then beat them all to death with the gun. Andreas Alves... Andreas asks, what do you identify as sexually? Well, Andreas, I identify as a disembodied floating head. Zippy wants to know, are you actually an uncle? Yes, Zippy. Yes, I am. Nutty Natty 99 fucking hell. Wants to know what motivated me to start making these videos. Well, uh, me and a friend, we, we know a guy who has a YouTube channel. It's, it's sinfully dull. And every time a new video comes out, we will sit down together and we will laugh at it. But one time when he brought out a new video, instead of sending the link over to my mate, you know, oh, he's got a new one out, I made a response video to it and sent him the link to that instead. And really, I just, uh, I haven't stopped doing that. It was great fun. I seemed to get a great response from it. So I thought, hey, you know, let's, let's, let's start doing it on a wider scale. Beyond that, it really, it comes down to uh, boredom, a fucking sparse bank account, and an inability to grow up. Lord Blackworth wants to know the thing I just spoke about, so you're good there. And any advice for people looking to start up? Oh yeah, mate, advertise. Shamelessly. Go on to the channels of YouTubers you admire, go onto their videos and st stick your link on the bottom. Most of them are very good about uh, leaving the links up there and sometimes they do actually come and look at your shit as well, which is really cool. And to anyone who is starting up at the moment, feel free to advertise on my videos, guys. There's 2,500 subscribers there. Let's share them out a bit, yeah? Help yourself. Wild Block, Wiley Block, Willy Block wants to know, what's your favourite video game series and movie? I'm going to assume you meant series there. Apologies if you didn't. Uh, I am a slut for the Mass Effect games. I'm dead excited about the new one coming out, you know, in the next decade or so. And as for movie, well, it's got to be the Avengers, hasn't it? Bow Fish would like to know, would you rather kill a feminist or murder a feminist? Murder does have some quite serious legal connotations, so I'd opt for kill and then just plead innocence. Oh, b -b 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 would like to know, where are you on the political spectrum? Yeah, I'm slightly leaning to the left, but, uh, you know, nothing to an extreme. But I mean, ideally, I'd be bang in the centre, you know? Fuck everyone. The Northern Dog Star asks, why are you worse than Hitler, literally? I don't know, mate. Fucking osmosis? I ain't got a clue. Nicholas Cool Guy says, how old are you, and are you really that broke? Uh, I am not as old as my avatar would suggest I am, but no, I am genuinely that broke. Metallichurch wants to know if I would ever do a video drunk. Way ahead of you, motherfucker. In fact, one time I did a video sober and it wasn't very good. Doc Craft asks, have you ever fucked a woman with a dick? Well, well yeah, how else am I supposed to do it? Cantonese Warrior would like to know if I'm royalty, and if so, what's my title? Uncle Baron, Duke or Cunt? Uh, no, I'm not royalty, but, you know, fingers crossed, one day, if I off the queen, I might just be able to slip in her place. Tape it to what asks, is the phrase, I won't stop, part of rape culture? Why, yes, it is tape it to what, because everything is apparently rape culture. City fan Chris, after a little bit of bum licking, asks, have you ever danced with the devil in the pale moonlight? Only the one time, city fan Chris, because he got a bit handsy. Lose Intelligence would like to know, are there any smaller YouTubers that you enjoy and would like to promote, and do you actually have any nieces or nephews, or is this whole uncle thing just a sham? I do have nieces or nephews, and they are the bane of my life. As for the smaller channels that I enjoy and would like to promote, please guys, do yourself a favour and check out The Academic Agent, who is one of the most informed channels out there. And one of my personal favourites, Alco Heretic, who has the dulcet Texan tones that I crave on a day-to-day -day basis.
Firefox is red, Explorer is blue, Google Plus sucks and Chrome does too, has one of the best names in the world and also asks, if the Trumpocalypse happened tomorrow and you could only use one type of beer can to fortify your holdings, what beer would it be? That is a very interesting question and one I had to think about for over two minutes. But the conclusion I came to was Carlsberg. If they got into a fight with a load of Foster's cans, trust me, they would kick ass. And they are so durable, I am surprised you can even recycle them. You can do it asks, are you an inner huh, or an outie? Let me just check for you there, you can do it. I am an outie. High five, anyone? Nope. No one. Game Pro Delta, it, well, I do prefer Game Pro Alpha, wants to know, where did the idea of your channel's name come from? Well, the idea behind that, Game Pro Delta, was everyone has an uncle who gets drunk and just says what the fuck they want at family events. And uh, I thought that could be me. Canal GXZ asks, what's your favourite drink to get drunk? Well, Canal GXZ, beer! Though I am partial to a bit of whiskey. And Rani asks, did you get the inspiration for the drunken uncle head from the game Operation? No! Kind Heathen asks, what's your favourite colour? I like purple. Kind Heathen then asks, what's my favourite colour? Um, red? No, blue! He then goes on to ask, what is the airspeed velocity of an unladen swallow? Do you mean an African or a European swallow? He would also like to know, if I could cryogenically freeze any SJW, like Han Solo, who would it be? Oh, that's an easy one, Milo Stewart, because then I could use her chin dimple as an ashtray. Continuing with his bombardment, Kind Heathen then asks, boxers or briefs? Well, why not both? Do one on top of the other, dare to be different. He would also like to know, if I was stranded on an island for 10 years, what three things would I bring with me? Two Swedish women and a bottle of rum. Now taking a slightly more serious route, Kind Heathen would like to know, what do I attribute the success of my channel to? Um, probably bad taste. And finally, Kind Heathen asks, who would you rather do? Adriana Lima's head on Leonard Nimoy's body, or Leonard Nimoy's head on Adriana Lima's body? Well, see, the important thing to remember here is that Nimoy copped it a little while back, so, you know, he's dead now. So, I mean, it would have to be uh, uh, Adriana Lima's body, because I, I just don't want bits getting everywhere, you know? That and, of course, the genitals. Corresponding genitals are very important to me. So that's it, then. We're all done. Special shout-out to my guys supporting me via Patreon. I want to suck your dick, but I'm looking into making you some exclusive content instead. And a less special shout-out to all of you guys for viewing, supporting, and commenting. Fuck, I love the comments. See you all again at 5,000 subs, and remember... I, I, I didn't think of one this time. Oh, well.